American football will soon be a core part of the school's sports curriculum once the pilot project in Nairobi is implemented successfully. The National Football League of the United States of America sent a team to Kenya to launch the pilot project that has 10 schools participating. The project, a partnership between the NFL, Kenya Academy of Sports, and the Kenya Federation of American Football, is targeting children between the ages of 10 and 12 to be introduced to a version of the game. Flag football, which is non-contact and is different from tackle, is where the journey starts in Kenya. The tackle is the one that, you know, mostly seen in the movies. And then the flag is the new concept that has been introduced just, you know, to make sure that the game can be spread all over. And it's also an internationally recognized um, um, event. It has already been introduced in Ghana, Kenya, the second African country for the project that will run for 12 weeks. There's a reason why the NFL is spreading its tentacles to Kenya and Africa at large. Base of African origin players either connect through their parents or their own birth place with Africa. There's about 125 playing in the league at the moment. Ownership has interest in it, the league, the players, you've seen the players are here with us on this trip. And it is not talent alone. The NFL would want to tap into the fan base to make the sport popular as they harbor the Olympics ambitions. They need to be strong in all the continents. The Kenya Academy of Sport is already thinking of having the sport in Talanta Hela, a mobile app that will give exposure to all talented youth. NFL is already strong in identifying talents using the digital platform. They identify a, a player or so, they're able to bring them on board, uh, check further and do the uh, measurements and agree that this talent is good for growth. The NFL brought in some of the players with African origin for the launch of the program. The players took the kids through some of the drills that their teachers have been taught. They will be back later in the year to assess the progress made. So that will be really exciting for us to see how, have, how have the schools get on, to see the children showcase their talent, but also then for us to continue to look to build the program. So the favorite part for me was to learn a couple words in Swahili and walk around town and say Sasa, Asante. And this is the only, this is the second annual camp that we've had here. Um, so it feels great that I'm being able to put my name at the beginning of this race. 2023 will be a big year as an all-star team will play in the Africa Championship. In 2024, there will be a World Championship tournament where Kenya might send a team. Michael Kinney for Citizen TV.